can't stand looking at that. The window to nowhere, I can't stand looking at that. It bothers me. It does. It's just ugly. It's just, it's just bothersome. It's visually distracting. I think I could just... I think so. Let me try this. I can't, I can't deal with it. It's just, you know, it's just like... There's no light in this room right now. Either. Need a light in Well, it's not that dark. I can work. But I got to do something. I can't, I can't look at this. It's bothering me. Fucking solar. My son's solar. It's obnoxious. It's obnoxious for sort of sort of like his father. You yeah, fucking little son of a bitch. Get it, man? See what I'm saying? What a fucking get over here, dude. No, I don't want to wrestle. I don't want to wrestle right now. Maybe we'll wrestle later. Alright? Wanna wrestle later? Wanna wrestle now? I don't wanna wrestle now. I love the shit out of this guy. Look at him. He's a fighter, just like his like his dad. Look at him. I'm so proud of him. I taught him, I taught him how to how to spar. He can take on bigger pigeons. He loves my one. See? You can always tell if a, a bird likes you, it won't be won't be by you. Right? He loves me. Don't you, soul? Tell him. No, you're not going. He's bad, though. He's really naughty. You're a naughty bird. Get in here. I just, I just can't look at it. It bothers me. It's distracting. It is. It's like... I'm thinking about doing something with it. Like, change it so it looks like it's outside or something. I don't know. I've done that. Like, I've, I've uh, backlit it. Bullshit. No way. What the fuck am I, what is this made out of steel? Get out of here. It's unbelievable.
Sore? Man, I'm trying to get shit done. I should not be screwing around with you. Son, you are out of here. You are so bad, dude. This guy is rotten. He is so rotten. What a bad bird. Come on, there, son. No! One son hang out with me. He's fascinated by his father. Because I'm a human and he's not. He loves the idea of that. Socks. I thought I could just drape it up here. Really, that won't work. Um, who have clothes? One just hand, huh? No, it won't. Let's try something else. If I, if I had nails, and I do, I, I don't know where they are. I just tag it up here, but I don't. I don't have nails. I did. I did. I had finished the nails, which would have been perfect. I don't know where they went. Which sucks. Let me see if I can find nails. Maybe, maybe I can. I bought them, man. I remember buying finishing nails.
Now, I did. I did find some roofing nails. Not deal, but I can always change it. I just, you know, it just bothers me. I just don't want to look at it. It's ugly. Shut up, Bill. I'm doing something, man. Hey, dude, give me a sec. Voila!
Well, we're having a good time now, right? I don't know if anybody's watching this. This is wildly exciting, huh? Cut it in first. I'm gonna roll it out. Hopefully, if the tracer won't slide on me, we'll be able to cut it all in. I like the color. Girl's gonna be taste. Oops. Come on. Hey, dude. Let me cut this in. Let me cut in this one wall. I just fed uh, her. I've been a baby. All right, hang on. That's it. It's not funny, man. No, it's not. It's not funny. It's not even slightly funny. Leave the cat alone.
seems to be making so much noise upstairs. I, mean, I don't know what he's doing. It's like he's building something. I'm going to take him B. I have gotten stuck on this morning. I got I got up. Um, I got up early. Sort of wanted to go back to bed and I didn't. So I got I got stuff I wanna do. I got the puppy going home. I got I got stuff I gotta do there with the puppy. So I wanna get some stuff done. I don't wanna just be like, I'm just working with the puppy. Gotta do my crap too. I hope he's ready to come home. Something's in the crap. I gotta go put a collar on him. She's being a dick. I had somebody contact me. They have a, a dog that has fear, fear problems, right? Afraid to walk away from the house, blah, 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 everything. And so I said, you know, I said, well, I do. I do board and train only. I told them, I said, that, that's what I do. Of course, they don't want to spend the money. Oh, that's too much money. Why'd you get the dog? This is like a puppy. It's a puppy. They're having major issues with the dog. It's all related to them, too. There's nothing wrong with this dog. This is, this is all bullshit that they created. And they're like, well, we were just wondering, you know, if, if we could just, uh, you know, do Zoom sessions with you. And then, and then after she says this, then she emails me one more time and says, uh, this is some woman from Morristown. She says, uh, we could buy an e-collar. Oh, God. You know, they, they, it's like they're bound and determined to fuck this dog up. More. Like, they, they've already messed the dog up. And I'm sure that they're, they're saying that it's the dog's problem. You know, it's the dog, it's the dog, not them. You know, they'll get rid of the dog too. I said, I said, if you, didn't, if you didn't have the money to spend on the dog, why'd you get the dog? You know, maybe they had a dog before, right? But all dogs are different. You, you can't, you can't treat one dog one way. You can't, you can't treat dogs all the same way. You can. There's a spectrum. There's a, there's a spectrum that all the dog behaviors fall on. So one dog might have been good with their bullshit, this dog isn't, but there's nothing wrong with this dog. Hey, where did the fucking crap? They are, they're, they're, they're at Fuck, soul! My son is rotten. You are rotten, dude. I like to blame this on his mother, but he's more like me than his mom, so. Get out of here, dude. But they did, they, they clearly have no idea what they're doing. They're not going to spend money on a dog, it's clear that trying to do something on the cheap. Um, she wanted me to call. You know, that, that's always like a fucked up sign. That's like somebody that thinks that I'm gonna say something on the phone that's gonna solve their problem. It's not the way it works. That's, that, that is not the way it works. It, it, it's similar to the people that are like on the channel, they have a dog, you know, things aren't going that great and they're looking for a tip. 
this was last night, there was somebody that was like doing this BS, like, um, I, I don't even know what they were talking about, it was, it was gibberish. I told them that, I said, you, 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 you're speaking gibberish. And then they told, they told me to get sober. Yeah, I haven't had a drink in, you know, years, like a real long time. 20, 20 some years, like 26, 27 years. That's what they told me. Get sober. Okay. You don't like, you don't like what, what I'm telling you? Or you don't like the fact that, that I, didn't, I didn't give you your free tip? I didn't, I didn't use my magic wand? That, that's what people that think. They think I have a magic wand. And it's, it's about consistency. It's about consistency. It's about repetition. You know, it, it's about working with the dog many times a day. How are they going to do that? They don't, first of all, they don't even know how to use a leash. You know, they don't know how to use an e-collar. They're just like, oh, they're willing to learn. Oh, okay, well... If you're willing to learn, do the goddamn board and train, and then after the board and train, then you'll learn in the lessons. But we got to get the dog going in the right direction. And you know the other thing? All these dogs that are screwed up like this, you got to get them away from the owner. The owners caused this problem. They don't get that. that it's an intervention. You have to get the dog out of there. You got to retrain the dog, and then you got to you got to train the people. And I'll, I'll tell you something. People that do board and trains don't waste their money. People that's looking to do stuff on the cheap, they don't do it. They don't do it. They just do not do it. This is a great color. I like this a lot. It's real nice. It's, uh, this floor paint, this acrylic floor paint is not expensive either. It's a real good price. The coverage is great. It's like 26 bucks a gallon or something. It's really reasonable. I, I guarantee you that they're labeling the dog. That it's 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 not it's not them. It's not them. It's the dog. That's how it's done. It's always the dog's stupid. You know? It's always the label of the dog. It's not the fact that they don't wanna spend any money training or they get improper training done. I think I think she even said that they were doing food based training. Right? Like they were using somebody food based training. That's your fault. I told you, you know, I told I could fix the problem, but they don't want to pay the money. The dog is not worth it. It isn't. They adopted the dog. The dog is not worth the money to have it fixed. It's a fact. That's how people look at it. Why am I going to spend eight grand on training this dog that I gave an adoption fee of? you know, $300. To, the, to them, it doesn't make any sense. They don't see it as like a, you know, just as worthy as a dog that you pay $3,000 for. They, they don't get it. People do not understand it. People suck, man, I'm telling you. It's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's all about making a buck. You know, or keeping their money. As it, it, as if, you, if you can, you can, you know, you can't take it with you. You can't. So why are you so fucking cheap? I can't stand cheap people. I can't. Dealing with cheap people is a sign that they're screwed up. You know, it is. It is. Cheap people really suck. I've never met a cheap person that hasn't been just fucked up in the head. 
they're always fucked up. And you know what? Usually they brag about their cheapness. It's like, what, what can I get away with? What can I get away with? I, I've seen this so many times. It's some kind of narcissistic thing. You know? It is. It's a narcissistic thing. What, what, can, I, what can I get for free? But, you know, it's just like, what, 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 what kind of damage, you know, is done to you that you've got to be so cheap, you've got to worry about every, every little fucking penny? I mean, how much, how much money do you need to live on this planet and, and feel, you know, have a roof over your head and eat? You know, what, what are you going to do? Are you going to take it with you? And they, I'm talking about people that aren't really like, they don't really seem like money grubbers. It's more about like, what can they get? You know, what 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 can they get away with? This color is awesome. I like it a lot. New palette, great taste. Seriously, it's real nice. It is. I might put I might go get another gallon of this. No matter what, I'm just put another gallon on it because it uh, I really like it. It's 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 a real nice color. It goes great. Yeah, that's a good choice. It's like a almost it's a grayish green or something. It's real pretty. Dogs. They have no idea what they're doing. They're not going to spend money on it. They are. They're not going to get trained. I have never met anybody. I, nobody that gets their dog trained regrets it. It's the truth. No one. But but people like people like they, these people. They're, they're never going to get it. Oh, that's ridiculous. I'm going to eight grand. To, to get my dog trained. Oh, we, can, we can't afford that on this dog. This dog is worth it. They don't even know what they end up getting when they get to talk back and be a dog that they would have loved, you know, and it would have been compliant, so they would have bonded to it. It's hard to bond to a dog that's like a mess. It is, it's, it's hard to bond to a dog that's a mess. It's easy to bond to a dog that is compliant and confident. I, I see this stuff so much. I, I get contacted by people all the time. I'm like, I'm not doing that. I don't need, I don't need your money. I don't, I don't need your money. Don't, don't waste my time. I, I'd rather deal with people, I'd rather deal with less people and people that understand that the dog's training is paramount. You know, it's an investment in the dog, not to these people. They, they screwed up a dog, they made it all fearful. I guarantee you this dog is fearful. Like there was something that the, the dog responded like negatively and I guarantee you the owner that I'm talking with is a chick. She did the old, oh, it'll be all right, bingo. You never console a frightened dog. That's too late. That's too late. You know, now, now, now they're trying to contact me. You know, that's too late. You should have watched the right video. You would have known this. Or they might have known it but not believed me and done it anyway. Pe people are freaking. People are freaking assholes. This color's awesome. 
This is great. This looks great. I, I don't know. I, I don't understand people. Sometimes dudes, it's like a macho thing. Like, oh, I can train the dog. Really? Why do you think that you can train the dog? Because you're so manly? Because you're going you're gonna to bully the dog into everything? You know? Why? Because you watch some stupid show with season one? So you, you think that you know what you're doing? That guy, season one is horrible for dogs. It's absolutely horrible. It's nonsense that he puts out. This is gonna look great. Seriously, this is gonna look real good. It is. It's it's, it's, it's bullshit. It's it's bullshit. That guy's all about making money. His gimmick or fame or something. It's probably more about fame. He he doesn't want to. Anybody that would contact that guy is just a sycophant. Dog whispering. Dog whispering is ridiculous. You might as well. Just, uh, that, that's all about, like, um, bullying the dog. Which you can use attrition. I'm not against it. I mean, we, we do that. Uh, dog trainers, we, we do what he does. He can't do what we do. You know, he doesn't use commands. It's, a, it's an absurd approach. You know, instead of saying no, he hisses at dogs. Like you would hiss at a cat. Except my cat. My cat will probably laugh at you if you do that. Yeah, I like this paint a lot. I got two gallons of yellow. Um, I was thinking about doing it on, on some doors, brighten up the kitchen. The kitchen's kind of dark. Because it's, it's gloss, so, um, you know, it's, it's real tough. It's acrylic, it's not latex. Victoria Stillwell, that's another one. She's real horrible. People love Vicky. Some people do. I'm not really sure why. She's, uh, she's, uh, she's not real good. She's like a failed actress or some shit. <clears throat> That, that purely positive shit with the food, it's a, uh, it's a real problem. Makes sense to people, which is the biggest problem. Look, the dog likes it. Like, as if, if it, because the dog likes something, that's, that's an indication that the dog should have it or you should, it should be used. That's, that's, that's ridiculous. Dogs like a lot of things. Dogs like, like a lot of things that aren't good for them. It's the truth. Using cheese and hot dogs to train your dog. That, that Jean Donaldson, she's real horrible. What's the matter with that woman? She's real off. I'm sorry to call somebody off, but she, she just seems off. You know? Um, 
I, I suspected um, she's like, oh, what's her name? You know, the autistic woman. You know who I'm talking about? That wears cowboy outfits. God, what is her name? Temple Grandin. She's real off. Her approach to animals is off. The meat industry should hire me. I have better ideas than Temple Grandin. But of course they don't. They want to hire the the freak, you know. I know somebody else who likes to trespass themselves off as like a, a savant. You know, it's just bullshit. Who isn't sort of off, you know? I'm an extremely literal person. I can't, I can't pick up sarcasm on other people. It's the truth. It's difficult. If I'm like... Um, Dating a sarcastic woman. I, did, I, I, was, I was sleeping with this comedian, right? And she's like super sarcastic. And she'd say stuff, and then it would take me like a day and a half to figure out she was being sarcastic. You know, like everything out of her mouth is sarcasm. I, you know, it was really difficult. Like, I'd be like, and then I'd figure, oh, she's sort of telling a joke. You know, because she is, she is one of those people, like, everything's sort of a joke. That's why she does what she does. It's funny. Like a, like a smart comedian. Like that. Smart female comedian. <clears throat> most comedians are sort of smart. This one's like Upper East Side Smart. She's likable. She's a likable woman. She wasn't, wasn't gonna work out with us. She had kids. It wasn't, it wasn't a problem with the kids. I liked the kids. The kids were fine. I don't care. I've dated, I've dated women with kids. I, it doesn't, I don't care. Fuck it. Just talk to them. Hey, what's up? Seriously, that, that's how I talk to them. Like, hey, what's up? What are you guys doing? They like me. Kids always like me. But that, that really wasn't the issue. It was just like, she's, she's on the Upper East Side. One, that was the big thing. Like she, 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 you know, she's hoity-toity. Um, She's on the she's on the east side. I liked her. I liked her, but you know, it sounds sort of like a or something. But she's on the upper east side, and I was in um, in the ghetto in Brooklyn. And to get to the upper east side, it just it just took too long, man. It was you know it was like a long time. Totally different though. Like, well, not not really. Like, I, I grew up in Clayton, Missouri. So, like, she's from an affluent family, right? I'm not gonna say who her mother is, but her mother's famous. And um, so, you know, she's on the Upper East Side. She had married somebody that had money. Um, you know, her mom's real famous. So. You know, I mean, I grew up in Clayton, Missouri, around affluent people, so it wasn't, you know, like I can, I can, I have no problem talking to people that are rich. Like, none at all. I don't care. Really, I don't care. I make it, I make it pretty clear. I, I talk to everybody sort of the same way, so it works. But it was just sort of, sort of strange, too, in that, like, uh, you know, like I was leaving her house and she called me a car service. You know, I said, uh, yeah, I'm kind of short on cash. I'll just take the train. She goes, no, it's already paid for. Oh, okay, okay, all right, thanks. She said, yeah, it's downstairs. This is sort of different than, like, like her lifestyle is just sort of different than mine. Like, um, like I was maybe a little bit of a novelty item. Um, like her... And I, I, I have other friends like this too, female friends that have money. Like I can, I can think of 
my other friend Jin in. Like I, I would imagine, I know, I know the one, the comedian, like that UPS truck is pulling up to her house daily with hundreds of dollars worth of packages. She just, you know, I, I, several times I was over there and, you know, she's like, oh, I gotta get my packages. Like, it was unbelievable. It wasn't just one or two. It's like, you know, like 10, 10 a day. It's just buying shit. I think my friend Jenny is sort of like that too. Like, she buys stuff now, I think, and doesn't even, like, I, I said, Junior, how many shoes do you have? So, oh, I got a lot of them. You know, and she has a shoe collection, but I bet she never wears any of them. Like, you know, she's like jeans and a flannel shirt kind of person. It's more like, like a sport. Same thing, same thing with the comedian. Like, well, you gotta do something. Might as well, you know, maybe I'll, maybe I'll need this pair of boots. You know, like that, like, you got nothing to do, you might, you know, you might as well buy some crap. I mean, I'll do that, I'm just like not really extravagant. I mean, I'm, I'm not extravagant at all. Sometimes I am. If I'm getting something for someone, I'm sort of extravagant. But for myself, not really. Food, I won't waste money on food. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll buy good food. I got no, no problem going to Wagner and dropping 150 on just cheese. You know, I'll, I'll just, I'll do that, like, no problem. That is not, that is not a waste. But like caviar, like I'll buy caviar, but I will I buy the cheap stuff. I'm not gonna buy beluga. It's just enough to eat the fish eggs. I don't I don't need expensive fish eggs. I just want to taste the salt, salt and fish together. This is a great color. Really like it. Interesting she picked green. Because that's originally what I wanted to use was a green. I was talking about painting the floors upstairs, but I'm not gonna paint the floors upstairs. I'm gonna do a rolling. Those things need to be dealt with properly so I don't have to like deal with there's birds up there, select birds up there. Got a video coming out, me and her. It's coming out. It'll be probably out tomorrow, most likely. Probably not tonight. Because uh, I'm, I'm going to be in this one too. I haven't shot my part. She's shooting hers, and then, you know, she's not here yet. She's coming here soon, though. Relatively soon. It'll be great working with her. Looking forward to it. She uh, seems like more than a more than pretty face. Some of those camera angles is a plus. That is a plus. Seems like, yeah, we shoot it from the trees. That's what I want to hear. Stuff like that. Listen, that's, that's somebody that sees an image. That's, that, 
that's sort of like, um, that's how I see it. I see it before I make it. You know, so a lot of artists do it. You see it in an image and then you produce it. Sometimes I just wing it. When I see it on the wing, when I'm making it up as I go along. I think I should uh, do this. I should move this. Let's take a roll over this. Let's pick this up. I'm going to leave this here. This table. Yeah, it's cool. It's great. It's kind of awesome. I like it. We like it. Who's that asshole solar? I put solar solar up somewhere. It's a real real bad bird. He is. He's, he's real naughty. Oh, Nick! Nick, see the one I, the one I pixie, the little tiny pixie. Nick, see the pixie. Oh, I got five bucks, man. Somebody gave me five bucks. That's really kind. Understated. It's classy looking. 
nice. Nice, new friends, nice. That's great, that, this is gonna look great. Here, I'll bring you guys back in here. Oh, here he is. There's solar tin. The worst, the, like the worst bird ever. What's up, son? No, don't, don't do this BS. No, you, no, you, you gotta go, you gotta go in the thing, man. Dude, I don't want I don't want to wrestle with you all the time, man. Come on, get in there. Why you got to look back? Pulling the crap out of that kid. I do. I love the shit out of him, but he's he's like. He always wants to do the same thing. It's always the same thing. Let's let's wrestle. I don't want to wrestle, Solarton. I don't. He's always insistent upon it. He's a real thick neck roller. Roll it back. Stuff goes on like butter. Contrary to popular belief, I'm really not that nuts. There's a lot of people that are crazy. I mean, that's for damn sure.
This stuff is so much better than the oil-based stuff. I mean, this is a this is a vast improvement, like coverage, everything. That oil-based crap. I went there thinking that that's what I had to get, and I said we don't even carry that anymore. It's all water-based. Really? It works good? They said, yeah, it's indoor, outdoor. Fuck that oil-based shit. It's a thing of the past. This is real, real nice. This is nice. Tell. You know, 
person's fashionable, you know they're going to have like an aesthetic, you know, they'll be pleasing. I'm not talking about the other thing, I'm talking about shit. Can you tell that by the art? Or what they wear? I'll put more down. I have more left. And I'll move this desk. Get that area. I knew she was a winner. This is great. People with taste. Look at discriminating palette. I saw a piece of art she made recently. It was a collage. It was like right into the bullseye. It's, it's like something you could see in a gallery in New York City. She, she does, keeps doing work like that. I gotta tell her that, by the way. I'll bring you meat in a minute, man. I've been working. Eat some Harrison's or something. I'll be up there a bit. Plastic. It'll be okay in two days. I'm gonna wrap it up real good. Maybe put it in the in the refrigerator. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do that right now. Wrap it up, aluminum foil, then plastic, then I'll put it in the refrigerator. Oh, I got it.
so see, see what I'm doing here? This way, I don't have to wash the roller, and then I, so it's aluminum foil, and it's in a bag, and then I put it in the refrigerator. Should be fine for two days. Tape, I'll tape it too. I get tape later. I'm gonna do a little detail right here at the edge. I would tape it, but just freehand it. Hey, dude. Be quiet. I'm doing something. Got the drill in there. It's great. It's real great. Let's pour this back in here. Sammy, I'm coming, dude. Quiet. I have to vacuum two, three times a day in my room. Why? cold here. It's like 67. All right, same thing. I'm, pu I'm putting this in a plastic bag. Sammy, I know. I'm coming, brother. I'll be there. Let me deal with this brush. Where's the lid? Did I leave it in here? It like 
Everything's sort of like doing con doing remodeling stuff. It's like everything just gets. Hey, Tracer, we'll work in a minute. I gotta make a smoother, dude. Awesome. Now, I gotta send Art Girl a message. Send, send an art girl a message. It, it is the truth. I saw this thing and I was like, holy shit. Hey, knock it off. Dude, yeah, play with your thing and let me do this. This is what this is this is what I told the people that didn't want to pay for the board and train. You are bound and determined to mess that poor dog up even more. I would have nothing to do with that and your plan and what your plans are. If you can't afford the dog, you should not have gotten it and should find a home for it before you do more damage. Please don't contact me again. I don't fuck around, man. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Lie to him? They want, they want somebody that's going to lie to them. We hired a treat-oriented positive reinforcement trainers, and in our opinion, they were garbage. But they don't want to listen to the, you know, they don't, want to, they don't want to pay money for somebody that's qualified. But they already hired uh, positive reinforcement food trainers. But they don't, they don't want to listen to me and listen, like, yeah, I can fix your goddamn dog. I can fix the dog, but I got to get it away from you because you guys are idiots and you already did the wrong thing. They already did the wrong thing. They want to do it their way. It doesn't work like that. And then they're like, the whole business of like the second email saying, oh, and we'd be up for buying an e-collar as if I would want them to use an e-collar on this fucked up dog. Remotely. It's me trying to explain what to do. It's absurd. It's absurd. They want to spend a couple hundred dollars to fix a dog. It costs you eight grand, but not only does the dog get fixed, it functions like every other dog that comes here. They don't want to do that. It's too much of an investment. They make me sick. They do. 
It's not even, they can't even look at it as an investment. They will get rid of this dog. They will label the dog fucked up. That dog will end up in a shelter. That dog, the chances of that dog dying are real good. 50% of all dogs that are acquired as puppies are given up. They're giving up the first year. This would be an example. They'll say, they'll say the dog screwed up in the head, but they did it. Dog's fine. Dog's got fine. They could give me that dog. That dog would do the dummy launcher. That dog would go in stores. They don't want to do that. They do eight eight thousand dollars. Are you kidding me? It costs money to have have a dog with you for three months. Yes, it costs money. People pay it too because they know that they're gonna get. They're going to get their money's worth. I can train dogs to do things other people don't. So it's their mistake. I would not, I don't want to deal with these people. Fuck them. I don't care if they like my channel. Whatever. You hired positive reinforcement trainers. You're idiots. They're freaking idiots. So, oh, we, we can't pay that much. Well, you're not going to pay any because I won't work with you. Jerks. You screwed up your dog. This poor dog. A dog deserves better. People are idiots. Oh, I'm going to Instagram. Okay, let me find our girl here. Um, I'm sure she knows this.
really, I wish I could show everybody this piece. I want to look at this again. There's a center note. Where is this? Where is this? I, was, I saw this, I was like, what the fuck? I can look at those and say, what the fuck? God. That is... That is... That is... Uh, well, you know... Jesus. Where is this? This is interesting, too. It's like a drawing. And then it's being turned into three-dimensional. She renders well. She does. She renders well. I don't think that's an opaque projector. I, I think that she draws well. Like, good hand eye. This thing. This thing is fucking amazing. It's like a photo collage. With... Painted aspects in it, I think. It's like it's like a photo collage, um, self-portrait. Um, I would hang. I I'd, I'd print this out. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I'm gonna see if she'll print this. We could, we'll take this to Walmart and get it printed. Giant. It's real nice. It look great in this house. It's real contemporary looking. It's real contemporary. Her face is in it, which doesn't hurt. I can't figure out if that's a... F no, that is a photo. She used a photo. There's, like, hands in it that I believe she painted or well it does it doesn't it doesn't matter it doesn't really matter because the end result is the piece is real sweet it doesn't 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 matter how she executed it it just executed great I can see this real big I could be like five feet by five feet or something. It's pretty amazing. I, I like, I like, I like seeing somebody like this that's like, wow, just pops it in, pops the, pops it into the bullseye. You know. It's uh, painterly. It's painterly, it's loose. There isn't anything really tight about it. But it has a tightness overall. It's, it's it's done. It's photo collage, but it's it's painterly. It's like it's loose. Um, it's an interesting piece. It it looks like it could be. It, it looks gal. It looks like it could be gallery size for sure. You just bump this thing up. Put it on a wall. It's nice. I was, I was like, it was a surprise because it was the last one of a series. There's like pictures of tagging, sort of, but it's not really tagging because there's like, it's, it's not mindless tagging. It's like, um, you know how some tags like in New York City, it's a scribbling. That's not this. That that is not this. This is uh, imagery. Imagery painted with spray cans on a wall. There's some words, but it's, it's imagery for sure. It's the last one of the series, like it's weird. Well, I'm here. Let me, get, let me go look, look, look at some more. They're enjoyable to look at. Hang on. She probably knows I'm looking. I don't care. Look at it. It's 
pretty amazing. Yeah, where to go? Okay, here we go. Here's the front page. She's got this. Um, she's got this one self-portrait that she did, um, where she's in a field. She's wearing shorts and like a tube top. Hair's blowing. Um, it's pretty, pretty cute. Uh, working at the mo at a motocross thing, being the, the card girl. That's an interesting photo, but I don't think she took that. I'm looking for the ones that she took. Um, this one's interesting. Um, leopard skin. Um, like leopard skin. Uh, is that a dress or a nighty? It remind it does. It reminds me of Cindy Sherman. Um, several of these are just like uh, right out of Cindy Sherman. Um, here's here's one that it's just like her her long hair, God, jungle hair, that's what she calls it, she's in, she's in the forest in, uh, in Florida, I'm giving you a blow by blow of what I'm looking at, here's one that sort of, what year did she do this, this is 2020, she's an adult, I can look at this, um, she's by some kind of field, by, uh, it's got nice, cute ears. Uh, she looks real young in this one. She looks young, like there's like an innocence going on in this one. Like, once again, Cindy Sherman has asked. Um, that's what it reminds me of. Well, here, here's one where she's sort of, um, this, look, this looks like it was a modeling shot or something, but she's taking it with her phone. She looks good in shorts. She's got a flat stomach. She's athletic, although she said she's not. Um, uh, oh, uh, I'm just don't want to be Laura Croft. Okay, see, once again, it's sort of Cindy Sherman-esque. Um, here's an abandoned, she likes abandoned stuff. Like, looks like an abandoned, like a, uh, Carnival place or something. Those bleachers, I'm not sure what it is. It's abandoned though. There's a manatee. Here's another one that really got me a Cindy Sherman. I don't know what year this was. 2020, I can look at this. She's adult. Um, th this is one where I really was like, oh, Cindy Sherman. So she has this, it looks like a motorcycle jacket, right? But it also could double as a letter jacket. Something like that. She's looking off in a distance. She, she's almost cheerleader-esque. She has pigtails going, right? Um, it's, it's about motorcycle. I don't, I don't know what... It's a, it's a cute picture. It's cute, but it also really reminds me of Cindy Sherman for some reason. Like, um, she's setting it up with a, with a tripod. You know, she's, she's taking this herself. When I first saw this, I was like, oh, somebody got her to model. That's not, that's not what she's doing. Is it, it's her doing it. Um, there's her with, with some butterflies. interesting see now this definitely looks like a, a modeling picture I maybe she was modeling here these pics would be way cooler if I had wings or horns or something um I when, what year is this 2020 I can I can look 
She's she's young. If you keep scrolling, it goes like too far. Not fucking when she was a kid. Um, it looks like she was on like she's on a runway. I'll have to ask her about this. I do not know if those are like she was modeling something. Um, I don't know. Now here's here's an interesting self portrait. Um, yes, I'm young, but I know just what I like. That's the title. And um, she's she's in a jungly area. It's a it's a face shot pretty much. It's a head shot, and she has some flowers in her hand. Um, I will, uh, I will say this about her. As far as, like, being photogenic, Jesus Christ. Um, here's another one. Oh, God. She's, she's, uh, she's on a beach, sort of, like, by a river inlet or something. She's wearing a bikini. She has a large leaf on her head. Do you like my sun hat? It's actually an elephant ear. It's an elephant ear. Um, it's a kayaker. Um, is she pressing insect wings? Oh, she is. She has a, uh, is that a monarch? What is this? No, it's, no, it's not a monarch. Kind of back butterfly wings. I don't think it's a... It sort of looks like a monarch, but it's not. But it's not a swallowtail either. I don't know what... I don't know what... I don't know what it is. Shouldn't do that. That was last year this time. Oh, huh, look at that, that's a pick-me-upper pill, there, like a, you know, mushroom type pill, and where, how old is she, this is May 2022, she's an orchid, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a live photo, the girl, the girl needs no makeup. You know, like that. Kind of pretty. There's another butterfly. What is she listening to? Um, I couldn't tell. Listening to Mac, Fleetwood Mac. I like Fe Fleetwood Mac. Um, oh, hang on, let's find out. I don't know who that is. There's a picture of her. Looks like in her home. It says, let me out of here. I don't think this is the same place that she lives now. It's one of that leopard and some Doc Martens. Stalk I'm stalking my new, my new friend. Um, now here, here she is, she's, um, isn't this fascinating, watching me stalk my, my new pal? Um, she says, let me out of here. She probably wanted to go. I have a feeling she was somewhere that she didn't want to be. Um, 
She's wearing the leopard skin thing. It's kind of slinky looking. It's pretty hot. And um, she's taking a picture in a mirror, but she's using a cannon. She's using a cannon with a big lens on it, like a, it's not a 55. I don't know what it is. I don't know what cannon she has, the D3. I don't know what she has. It's a good camera though. There she is again. Same, same time frame. Sort of angel faced. Am I sounding creepy? <laughs> it doesn't matter, fuck it. Um, this looks like a modeling shot. Th 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 this looks like she could be modeling for a magazine or something. Like a skateboard magazine or something. Just wear them right. Um, set a five star hotel somewhere. Some art with a butterfly. More art with a butterfly. Um, well, this is a great shot. So I saw this too. Um, I, I thought that this was somebody taking a shot of her. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Um, she's, she's in like a, a Ford, like an old Ford truck, like from the 40s or something. But it's all, it's all, it's cherry, man. It's, it's really tricked out. She's wearing like a red and black, like, dress. It's tight, it's tight. It looks, looks great. Sort of has like a country feel to it. Um... Where'd that go? Um, I gotta, I gotta figure out if she, uh, she took this herself. Um, maybe, maybe that's like one of the family's cars or something. Because I, I see a shelf in the background that's got like stuff that somebody might have in their garage if they worked on stuff. No, this is, two, seven, this is uh, 2019, maybe it's not. I don't know, but it's a great picture. Okay, this is where I'm gonna stop looking. I think. It's going back too far. Not really, just an adult. Um, artwork um, I don't know maybe in Puerto Rico I think I don't know abandoned buildings I don't know all right there you go it was there I figured I'd look again because I looked before um, I'm not drinking tonight. Well, that's probably good. Don't. I might have a kombucha. Um, very interesting. Very interesting. What's up? What's everybody doing? He's checking out his intern, the collab. I was checking out the intern's Instagram, the collaborator. Um, wow. Photogenic, that's for sure. Very artistic. Very artistic and very she's more than just pretty, clearly. She did it she did a piece. I think it's recent. It's a collage. And what I was doing was I was I was uh, messaging her, telling her that it was great. And if she's gonna she if she should probably pursue that direction if she was gonna do a series, it's it's um 
it's got loose elements, but it's tight because it's a, like a, a photo type collage. Um, like uh, she could definitely get, she could definitely show. Maybe I need a muse, Peter. I don't know what you're trying to imply, but um, I do need somebody to work with, and she seems perfect. Um, to this is meant, I meant to keep going. She seems perfect. She can wear costumes for sure. We can we can dress her up. She can be multiple, uh, multiple different looks. Like um, easy, easy if you look like that. Uh, mind control is the best. Are are you trying to? Who are you trying to mind control me? Don't mind control me. Don't. I've had that. I've had somebody try that with me. I can't. I can't be hypnotized. By the way, it can't happen. It can't. I know somebody that was affected by a hypnotist. I know somebody that says that they weren't hypnotized, but it sounds like they were. Oh, am I controlling your mind, Tammy? Tammy's kneecaps. Who remembers the riddle? Peter Piper picked a pepper. Probably everybody. Yeah, Sensei. Sensei Peter Kane. This is our dojo. Welcome, my friends. Oh, it's really great work. Really great work. Um I wouldn't I wouldn't I wouldn't want to work with anybody that wasn't um sort of exceptional and one regard or an artistically. It seems like I, I have like a thing for um, art, artistic women that are smart. That seems to be my deal. I don't know what it is. My mom, my mom was smart. But it's interesting enough, my mother, my mother could paint, she painted when, it, when we were young and then she never painted again. And then, um, but my mother's temperament was extremely artistic and um, my mom, my mom hot, I, she was my mother, I don't know. Um, but, I mean, clearly I became an artist. She took me to the Van Gogh exhibit in first grade. I made my mind up then that I was gonna make art. You don't have to be hypnotized to quit doing something. You just have to get it right in your own head. Getting hypnotized is bullshit. You don't want to do it, then don't do it. That, that's it. You don't want to smoke, don't smoke. That's the secret. You just don't do it. And the other secret is, if, when you feel like doing it, do push-ups. That, that, that's, that's what I do. Do push-ups. Changes the endorphins in your brain and you can move on. Oh, okay. Well, whatever, Tammy and your kneecaps. How are your kneecaps doing? Are they good? Are they like titanium? Look at that, I got $8 on the board. I don't know what I did to deserve that. I'm not gonna get my hair cut today, but I am gonna get my hair cut real soon because now I don't have to wear a mask. Who else is fully vaccinated that doesn't have to wear a mask? Raise your hand. I don't have to worry. I, I told the collaborator, I said, you don't have your shot, you could come up and get it up here. I'm not worried about getting it. You. You. It's great, right? I was just talking about you. I went to the vaccine, then I didn't, don't know why. Why? It's safe, come on. I didn't have any side effects. I, I'm, man, I don't have to wear a wet. As soon as I got both and it was 12 days after, I was like, I don't have to worry about, you know, a bad outcome. If you get this, the worst thing that happens, it sounds like you're like a, asymptomatic. That's it. My grandparents said that you get a, why are you listening to your grandparents? They probably listen to Fox, you know, come on, Jade. 
that one of one of one of them, the Johnson and Johnson, right? Out of six million people, six people had some blood clot issue. So why are you listening to old people? They're probably listening to Fox. They're probably like listening to QAnon. Uh, we are in the UK, so we don't watch Fox. Yeah, but there's right wing crap over there, Jade. Don't listen to right wing crap. It's just, you know, come on, Boris. Don't, you know, do it, do whatever you want, but, you know. Yeah, can contraceptive pills, you have more of a chance of having blood clots than one out of every six, one out of, one out of a, a million? Those are great odds. You don't know the long-term effects of what? The vaccine? I'll tell you something, dude. You're talking crap. You don't know the long-term effects of COVID and the vaccine. This is a fact. The, the components of both the, the Moderna and the Pfizer, they're all similar to the components of other, other, like, like the flu shot. The components are the same. So what are, you, what are you talking about? You're talking about QAnon crap? You don't know. I mean, it sounds like there's more uh, stuff associated with getting it. I'll take my chances with science because they've been making the flu shot for years and the components that they use to make it, it's the same stuff. I'll take my chances. Yeah, long-term effects of COVID are terrible. I'll give you another example that you don't know what you're talking about, okay? Look at Zika. Look at the Zika virus, okay? They didn't know that what, what, you know, what the big deal was, and then all of a sudden they find out that it causes children to be hydrocynephic and shit. It's, 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 it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I, 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 don't, I don't know what people's problems are. I, I, listen, it's science. I'll, I'll go with science every time. Do ASMR. I'm, th I'm waiting until my collaborator gets up here because I think people would rather see her do it than me. I'll just chime in every now and then. Almost everybody, I would say, I would say everybody in this chat, everybody that is on my channel is sort of like me, like logical, but it's strange, it's strange. I've dealt with people like in the last year that you would think would understand, you know, like, but they're sucked into right wing conspiracy. I don't, you know, I'm not going to go into it other than that, but I mean, like I have family members that are like, you know watch Fox and they believe the crap. They're, they're Republican. I was Republican for years. There is no way, thank you, William. There's no way that I'm gonna vote Republican. That isn't even the Republican party as we know it anymore. That's not a conservative approach. That's anything but conservative. They're out there lying. They're, spread, they're spreading stuff. They're, they're spreading freaking lies just to win they don't care they they don't care it's unbelievable this QAnon stuff they don't care they don't care the republican it's 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 a disgrace it is it's a disgrace i i really i can't see voting for any republican hey mitt romney I don't have a problem with them. Cheney, I don't have a problem with her. She's standing up for the Constitution. Who else is? Certainly not Lindsey Graham. What happened to that guy? What happened to the him? Lindsey Graham. What? A, that's a disgrace. Are these people that are like, well, we're gonna we're gonna keep backing Trump because like he's real popular. He's real popular among morons, is what it is. But morons vote. It's unbelievable. It is unbelievable. Ah, that's good. It is. That's all they care about. They, they know that these people, you know, 
will vote for them as long as, you know, they keep going with this stuff. It's disgusting. It is. It's disgusting. I never thought our country would be like this, ever. I never thought that we would end up in this situation. And here we are. I never thought I had to worry about it. I never thought that I had to, like, really watch the news and keep, you know. I'm drinking kombucha. God, that's good. I got to see how my video is doing, see if I got any. It's doing good. Isn't that, I don't even know what you mean by that. I think you're just trying to sound smart. Isn't that, what? It just, that just sounds like you're trying to like, like, like you don't even really know what you're talking about. Um, this one is pretty good. It's uh, ginger lemon. Um, I, I, I can't tell a story like that right now. Um, I, wa I want to see if my, um, my video where I'm complaining about stupid people. Oh, it's okay. It's nothing great. Why, it's a great day. I probably could make a Discord ser server, but I really don't. Uh, honestly, he should be a comedian. I can't even look at him without laughing. Oh, gee, thanks. Yeah, because I'm funny, because I'm a comedian, dick. Oh, yeah, right. Uh, most anti-vaxxers are very educated on what's going on. You should stop watching MSM. MSM? BC? Is that what they mean? This stuff, honestly, just comes down to what people choose to believe. I don't watch MSM, but I'm still pro-vax. Um, uh, Nancy here has to go, because uh, it's a moron. Um, hey, I bought... Hey, I bought $20 worth of gas, and I was already chill and wait, but nice to have a full tank. Oh, okay. Thanks for telling us about that, like we really care. Um, th 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 thanks for telling us that you got gas in Virginia. Pulling the right wing is pathetic while well, claiming to have been raped by Bigfoot is the dumbest shit I've ever seen. Really? Okay. Uh, that's a false equivalency. We'll, we'll approve this and I'll tell him that. Um, here's, a, here's somebody that is posting something about the CDC. I'm just going to remove it because I don't know what they're... I'm not clicking on it. Um, so, um, so now I'm going to go and tell this guy that that is a false equivalency. Okay, th this is a QAnon person. I, I have a tendency to make the QAnon people upset because I actually have facts. I'll, I'll read the New York Times. You know, the stuff that our last president said was fake news. If you don't like it, it's fake news. That's not how it works. That isn't how it works. How are the dogs? Dogs are good. Everybody's cool. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta work with the puppy here. Hang on, let's find this dude. Um, it's a genius. So one of one of his geniuses. Okay, here's this um, Christian. Okay, this 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 guy has to go. This, this is a uh, this is a right winger. Nut job. Um,
Uh, that's a false equivalency. It's called a false equivalency. One has nothing to do with the other. You sound dim. I'll lose this guy. He's a sub for how long? One month. Who cares? You're dim. Um, okay, here's here's somebody. You could always tell most of these people like they don't they don't have a um, uh, you know they don't have a picture like like some of these might be they, they, these could be like totally. Well, Tammy doesn't have a picture too. Um, but like if you don't have a picture, it's sort of like uh, you know. Sort of looks like, um, here, we'll get rid of this person. Um, here, uh, you are brainwashed, one who thinks you are safe from a political pandemic. This person thinks that it's not real. We've had a half a million people die in the United States alone. Half a million, and he's calling it, it's politics. people died in every country you know but this guy some countries don't have these people like US Brazil Russia they took this approach the politicians like saying no it's no big deal you know um, so that this guy Bill we'll just get rid of him because it's, it's just not worth it okay so we'll, we'll hide user from channel all right. Yeah, you got you got to stay up on this crap. I, I can't I can't have these people on my channel. Um. So there you go. Even here in Australia, we have been in lockdown, and people complain about it. It's just, it's nonsense. Uh. Well, I'm working on the house. So I don't really want to do a house tour right now. I'm worth, I will at one point, but there's, you know. Um, you know. Queensland has zero cases, no shit. How'd they pull that off? Did everybody do a mask and then they were like that? Look at Taiwan. Taiwan, um, South Korea, too. But see, th th there were people here that just don't believe it's real and wouldn't wear a mask. It's ridiculous. We have people that won't get the vaccine. It's sad, but true. I don't fucking know, man. We got a new vampire coming and she's hotter. How about that? You'll like the new one, all right? You will like the new vampire, so stop bringing up Cherry Bomb, because she's, um, there was no lockdown in Taiwan because they all wore masks and did what they were told. She's, she's a better vampire, okay? Better Cherry Bomb, better actor, better artist. Well, uh, the last Cherry Bomb's a pretty good artist. She makes some pretty good work. Um, but this, this will be the new improved, all right? You, you'll, you'll like, you'll like the new one, I guarantee you.
Oh, Pachinko's here. Hey, buddy, how you doing? How you doing, pal? What's going on, buddy? Hey, Pachinko, what's up, pal? How you doing? Where are you? Are you just lurking there in the background? Oh, hey, pal, how you doing? Look, everybody, it's Christy. Hi. How you doing? Quiet. It's everybody's pal, Christy Pachinko. Christy Fox, whatever. No, you're, you're a minch. You're, you're a total minch. Don't fool yourself. She is. She's a minch and she knows it. Um, uh, updated view. That's the one I want. Um, let's see. Oh, Matthew Kerr is flying with Jupiter. What's he doing? Hey, as you are probably aware, passengers flying with service animals need to form airlines who the trainers wanted to give you heads up that we will share. Oh, that's fine. That's totally fine. Feel over at a cover letter. S I N. I love Jupiter. I miss that dog. I had a falling out with his mom. She sort of treated me like crap. She did. She treated me like a slave. It was weird. Cover that sign, date my name. Oops. Okay, that's good. Fucking Jupy. That dog is ridiculous, Jupy. Fuck! I love that dog. That was tough making that decision. It was. It was tough making that decision. He ain't no problem. People, people, people are he, people are sometimes difficult to deal with. Dogs are simple. I always know what to expect. God, that's good. I'm just doing pheasant wings and slowly increasing the difficulty where to find them. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna take pheasant wings out in the field with um, the little freak. I'm gonna do that again. I'm gonna do that right now. That's a good idea. 
I painted my, uh, my new friend's floor, my new art collaborator's floor, um, the vampire's floor. I got that done. Looks great. Uh, I got that done today. I also planted, I gotta go check on these plants that I put on the ground. Troy. Took them out of a pot. A pretty, like a older type of plant. So I gotta go see, I, I put stuff on them so that they don't get total sun. Um, Uh, let me go check on those, see if they need anything. Hang on. Hang on.
all the winds. Let's take all the winds, put them out in the field, or maybe let's try this real quick. Let's go do let's go do let's go do this. We'll we'll run out here and do this, okay? You want to get us a shot first? Come on, let's go. You want to try this? Come on. We'll be right back. Come on.
fucking awesome, man. It's fucking awesome. Tracer just caught the frisbee. About four times. Tracer, go kennel. Oh, get what? Get what? No, baby, come here. Hey, Trace. Tracer, come here. Get some water. We did great. Tracer caught the frisbee. I gotta, I gotta shut this down and contact her, her dad. That's fucking awesome, man. We'll get you to do it real good before you go. I got, I gotta go. <laughs> I gotta go. This is this big deal. It's fucking awesome. Youngest dog I've ever caught or taught to catch the frisbee. Good job, Trace. I mean, she's, you know, we're not throwing it bar, but she's n nabbing it out of the air. Nabbing it out of the air. It's fucking great. It is. Thank you, Toxic. Toxic, how, how you doing? Everything good? You good? Good. Okay. Okay, I, I gotta go. I gotta contact her dad. That's awesome. I'll open something back up later. It's great. 